Okay, so I just wanted to show you uh, a clever little trick um, that, that really helps with an aging acacia rat. Now, all of my little ones right now, I'm into my fourth generation of the bloodline from the first rats I had. Um, so these are the great grandchildren of um, Lilu and uh, Autumn from years back. And... Um, I think it was pebbles was was getting was getting old and see I've got this nice um, sort of this is part of the setup that I've got and it's a dining area and bed box right and and she was she was getting too old to climb up this tube so so what I did hello ladies so what I did was I actually burned holes with a hot knife in the bottom tube because she was jumping up and she and she was kind of scrabbling to get up and struggling so I, I burnt holes in this tube just here and I burnt sort of and I made like a little a little ladder for her um, and I, I tried cutting them before but that leaves sort of jagged edges and that so and I found just get a just get a hot table knife uh, uh, get a table knife, heat it with with a lighter, um, and and then just burn a hole in it, and then heat again, and just repeat until you've put just on the bottom one, bottom tube, these little things, and she was straight back up there, and it um, it worked real good. Uh, hello, ladies. There's a hiding in there. Hello. <laughs> uh, um, but it works real great. And uh, if you've got a setup similar, if you've got little tubes for your acacia rats to climb in, um, and they're getting a bit old to climb up them, this works a treat. And now I now I have it on on all of my cages, um, so that uh, so that when they get old, they d they don't struggle, and that they're used to to climbing and using these. So, yay!